One thing you want to try is just canola oil and then put the dry ice in it just like you're doing that with water. I think it'll be pretty cool. So I'm going to pour some into this glass jar here and then take a piece of this dry ice, break it off, and drop it in. Ugh. Let me get that. That's pretty interesting. Let me knock that down. I can reach it if I can. Huh. Yeah, look at that from the side here. It actually it looks pretty cool. Now you can see that layer of gas around the piece of ice there. It's a little easier to see with the oil. That is pretty cool. Wasn't sure to what to expect whenever I put the dry ice in the oil, but I think it turned out pretty cool. Go ahead and take a look at this shot in slow motion. A really cool trick you can do with dry ice that I think is just fascinating. First of all, we just need to take a jar full of water and then some dry ice here. I'm just gonna drop this in the water. And we know it's just gonna start bubbling like crazy because that's what dry ice does and it's super cool. Just like that. Now I have a rag, a wet rag with some soap on it. What I'm gonna do is drag this over. It's a little bit tricky to get the bubble to start. Oh, that was close. Okay, now this is the cool part. Let's wait for this to pop. You can see the bubbles filling up with dry ice. It's just filling up more and more and more. And th the cool part's coming. Just wait for it. Now this just looks wild. Just wait a little longer. Wait for it. The dry ice is filling up that soap bubble. Wow, this is looking really crazy. And that is so cool to watch it hit the ground. Whoa. Wow, it's starting to do it on its own. I didn't even, wow, okay, that is really interesting. Let me, wow. Wow. Coolest bubbles ever.